Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. With Christmas quickly approaching, shopping for gifts is on everyone's mind. But when thinking of gifting a four-legged friend, it's important to consider the responsibility that coincides. I spoke with Pike County Animal Shelter on what you need to consider before adopting a new animal this holiday season. A lot of people like to adopt animals at Christmas time. They think it'll make it a, a great gift for, especially for children. They don't really look at the enormous responsibility it is for a child and the adults. Uh, cats and dogs require 10 to 20 years of commitment, uh, vet bills, uh, food, um, exercise, dogs require daily exercise, and a lot of other things. It's, it's actually a costly commitment. According to the shelter, following the Christmas season, rates of relinquishment increase as well as rates of animals being dumped. If you are interested in adopting for Christmas, and you are aware that it's gonna be a long-term commitment, I would recommend that you come to the shelter. Um, a lot of people like to go to breeders, but we have so many shelter animals that really need and deserve a good home. You can come in, put in the applications. Uh, we take you know name, address, phone numbers, make sure everything is accurate. And dogs are $25, cats are 20. Uh, we do often have pet fairs too. You can look into our pet fairs and see when we're doing those. Um, please just make sure that, you know, the animal is already spayed or neutered or is scheduled to be so. The Pike County Animal Shelter will be hosting a pet fair Saturday, December 15th. For more information, go to Pike County Animal Shelter on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.